Hey, what's up, Madden people? Crazy Hot Boy E here. This is for Edwin coming to you with another video. Today we're going to be doing a bundle opening, also a coin method, as well as a giveaway. Now the giveaway, if you want it to be entered, all you have to do is be subscribed to the YouTube channel and comment Barkley in the comment section. Or if you're following this on Twitter, all you have to do is retweet the link and like the link to be entered into the giveaway. Now, there's also going to be a coin method in this video, so definitely stay tuned for that. Now, I don't have the new coin method for the theme builders or the re-rolling just yet, um, but we'll definitely have that available at another date for you. But I definitely just want to show you something, a coin method that you can do with your other cards that you pull if you pull these packs. And then also show you the probability here. So 85, 100%, 87, 71, 90 is 20%, and a 93 is 7.9%. So I do want to let you know up front, we do pull a 97 in this pack opening. So that was pretty cool. Um, so let's get started right here. We get an 87 Bruce Irvin. We get a 76 TJ Yeldon. We get a power-up Tyran Matthew. And we get an 85 Juwan Bentley right there. So moving right along. I mean, that's not the best pack, but it wasn't the worst either. We could have got two 85s. As we get a 71 Bowser. We get a 77 Edwards. We get an 85 Solomon Thomas there. And let's see what we get here. We get another 85 BJ Goodson. So that's pretty much the worst of the worst packs that you can get, unless one of those 85 is selling for a lot. As we get an 87 Charles Leno Jr. there, we get a power up. We get a Joe Thomas. And we get an 85 Punter, Mr. Corey. And let's see here. We get a gold to start off with. We get another gold. We get a gold, we get a theme builder, 87 Matt Gay, and the 85 Punter. I mean, so I mean, it can't get worse than those three packs that we just pulled right there, so it definitely has to get better. And now we get a little legend here. We get an 82. We get a gold, we get a gold. We get a theme builder. We get an 87 Bruce Irvin again, and we get a 87 Mark Glenowski. All right, so I think I did one more pack before I was like, all right, let me check the odds on these again because I haven't got a 90 yet. I haven't got 93 or 95, and I got an 85 right there. I got a gold. I got a team of the week gold, and then we get another 85. So I just bag out here. I go over to the pack. I'm like, all right, um, what's going on? As you can see there, we're supposed to get a 90 um, 20 percent of the time. So, I mean, we've already pulled like 10 players, and we definitely did not get two 90s. So I don't know what's going on there. So we're going to go back to the packs here, and they do get a little bit better. So after we start off with a gold here, a gold there, we get an 85 there, and we get a gold, and we get another 85, and so yeah, that was a trash pack. Now we're down to five packs left. We get a gold. We get uh, theme builders, 85, and then we get the big theme builders. We get a 97 Cortland Sutton. So, I mean, not a bad pull. It is a 97, so that goes for 48,000 training. So, I definitely always take that. And then actually, to pull the new 97s, it's going to be 52,000 training, so you can reroll there, see if you get something better. Um, but, yeah, not a bad pull at all. I think we got four more packs left here. We got a small theme builders. We got an 87 Corey Ford. We got a power up there. We got another theme builders. We got an 87 Jerron Taylor. We got a power up, and we got another power up Mel Renfro. So, yeah, 85s and 87s are definitely flying out of these packs. So, I mean, that's probably going to be the move for the market right now. I'm probably buying up a bunch of 85s and 87s and putting them into the set as we get three 85s right there. Um, if that's not the move or they make something else, um, I'll definitely let you know. But there's only one set right now, and that set is you can put 85s or 87s seven times to receive a 90 plus, And as we get a 90 right there. I'll definitely go over that set as well, too, so you're in the game. And let's see here. I think we're coming up to our last packs here. As we get an 85 Solomon Thomas again, we get a 78. We get an 85 Nathan Gary, and we get a 72. All right, yeah, now this is our topper. You get two toppers of these, 90-plus steam builders, as we get a 95 Kirk Cousins. So you can't pull a 97 out of this pack. I mean, so that's good if you buy the topper bundle. And we get a 90 Cole Holcomb there. I mean, so not the best pull right there. And now we do have 5,000 training here. So I'm going to go over to the 85 theme builders reroll set and just show you 
for 2400 coins what it's looking like out of two packs first one there we get an 87 and then the next one here we get a I believe we got 87 as well too yeah we got 87 Connor Williams right there as well too so yeah once again we're doing a giveaway for Saquon now at the time of this he actually wasn't up on the auction house um, but let me go ahead and just show you a couple of his pieces and what they're going for right now. So, I mean, I don't think he's going to stay expensive. Um, right now, the last time I looked, he was about 700k. I'll definitely show you that. But, yeah, as we go over here to Saquon here, we have a Marcus Golden. At the time of recording this, he was going for about 275 I mean, so, I mean, looking at that price, I can actually see why it would be 700 when I first looked at it. And then the kicker is going for about 230 um, but that's definitely going to drop down. I opened this bundle up as soon as the um, packs came out today. So I definitely want to show you guys what was in the packs. As you can see, the lowest overall card is going for about 20K. I mean, so that's pretty much on point where it usually goes on. And now for that coin making method for the pack, drafts, pack trash, it looks like you only received one or two maybe golds and not everything else was coming out power ups. So once again, I'm going to show you this harvest set, the 77 to 79. Go ahead and put your golds up in there, or you can buy the golds off the auction house. And you got to remember, you can get these down for about 1,100 coins, 1,200 coins, if not less. Um, and then you're going to go ahead and pull a card. Once you get your harvest card, as I got a 79 there. Now, I'm not going to sell that one and put it into the set just because a 79 goes for a little bit more. But if you do pull like a 77 or a 78, you see it's not going for that much, or you know it's not going for that much, just go ahead and back out. Go into the turkey stuffers, put in the turkey stuff instead. Go ahead and hit the wild card as we put a 78 in there because the 78s are going for about 2100, which is a little less than the 2400. So we go ahead and pull this one here. And we're going to take, I believe, here a uh, Quinn Nelson, if I'm not mistaken. So let me see here. We got to, let's see. Yeah, we take Quinn Nelson right here. Nope, not Bosa Nelson. So yeah, as you can see, when you pull that first set, the 77 to 79, you're going to get back a card. If you get a 79, great, you can sell that. If you get a 77 or 78, don't sell it. I'll show you why. And remember, you did the set for about 1,200 coins or 1,000 coins with your pack trash, if even that. And this card, Quill Nelson, he goes for 2,800 coins. So you did the card for 1,200 coins. He goes for 2,800 coins. You get back 1,400 coins to make profit there. And then also a Daryl Worley. He goes for 2,400, which is why we didn't sell the 79. You can go ahead and just sell him for profit right away as well, too. So I know a lot of you going to be buying packs. So, yeah, if you're buying the packs and you run out of coins, that's what you can do. As you can see, that Kirk Cousins there is going for about 170K. That's definitely going to drop down in price. But I'm going to go ahead and try to get him off right now just to make a little coin stack. So we put him up for 149, and I believe he ends the sold. And I do want to show you one more here. That 97 Carlin can't find him there, so we just go ahead and shift this over to Elite. And then uh, where is he at? There he goes. We're gonna go ahead and click on him. So at the time he was up for about 700k, but yeah, that's obviously gonna drop in price. So not gonna be 700k. And let's see here. All right, but I did try to put it up at the time being just in case we could have got an early buyer. I mean, that's always good to do. So we dropped it down for a little bit last 670. And we go ahead and put it up. But it didn't sell for that amount, which is fine. We got coins out of it anyway. As you can see, the Kirk Cousins Insta sold. So yeah, sometimes we do it at work. Sometimes you do it, it doesn't work. But I definitely want to show you as we get a Theme Builders 2 welcome pack here. They give you an 84 TJ Watt and also a theme builder's mutt tip. So that's not bad there. Just go ahead and click sell those. And now we're going to go ahead and tab over to the auction house. And I'm going to show you what Barkley is going for. And this is going to be the card that you're also getting in the giveaway. So as you can see here, he's going for about 700k coins. So we're definitely going to be giving that away once again to be entered into the giveaway. All you have to do is be subscribed to the YouTube channel and comment Barkley in the comment section. Or if you're on Twitter, all you have to do is retweet my video link and also like the video to be entered there. 
And I do want to show you my one fifty, one dollar fifty pack, the ninety ninety five theme builder, just in case you were thinking about spending a dollar fifty. This is what I got back. I got a ninety Colton Miller, and then the last one here. I'm going to show you the exchange set. Now there's only one exchange set. It's seven seven eighty fives, eighty sevens for one ninety ninety five. So depending on what the eighty fives are going for, this definitely might be worth doing. So I just go here and I filter through to see the cheapest 85s I have. I don't even know which one's the cheapest. I just pick the ones that look the worst. And yeah, I'm going to show you what I get there. And so yeah, if you like the video, definitely go ahead and leave a like on the video. I definitely have more coming for you. Ultimate Legends do come out tomorrow, so we're going to be doing a pack opening for that as well. And probably a giveaway, depending on what card comes out. And let's see here, we get a 93 Coke, so... Yeah, thanks for watching the video. You guys have a great day and better tomorrow. And I will see you in the giveaway to see who wins. Let you guys know. And you guys have a great day. I will holler later. Peace.